feel terrible. How did I even get back here? Did someone carry me? Now boarding on platform 2, a local train to Avalon, stopping at Scarford. I'd really love to know why that particular pen smells of cheese. Bloody hell. Oh, bloody hell. Place yourself, Arthur. Well, it doesn't kill you. I wish I kept in shape. Oof. Someone threw a whole bunch of medical supplies all around here. I, I think I must have stepped on an infected needle. W would you help me clean it all up before someone else gets sick? If I stick my fingers in that pond, won't I get infected too? Well, it's not going to clean itself up. That looks awfully unhealthy. I'm not sure I'd enjoy getting stuck with one of those needles.
Look, a friend of mine buried some nice things by the bloody rock. And I owe you something. You can have them. Which bloody rock? Not the bloody rock. The bloody rock. The one where they were cutting up those rats. You can't miss it. You can smell it from 50 feet away, and it's got blood and flies all over it. to do this. Getting old. You've built a lovely tree house. 
Mine was never this grand. Welcome to the Special Operations Executive. You're the new agent, aren't you? Alfie, what's his name? Great. Here are the other agents. This is Charlie Croker, Jack Carter, Gonville Bromhead, Joe Bandeleur, and Nigel Powers. But we're missing Peachy. Peachy Carnahan. He's been kidnapped, and you have to rescue him. All right? Brilliant. Here's everything you need to rescue Peachy. The house they're keeping him in is pretending to be a puppet theater. But it's really a den of spies. Well, that's one way to stay sane out here. Go stark raving bonkers. I think I used to run a hundred meters. Maybe I should sit down for a bit. What happened to the gardens? I used to have gardens. What am I supposed to do with all the this? Really love Uncle Jack, don't they? We are not following me. What rough beasts, Slout. <sighs> darkest before the dawn. Where are the Russians? Come in here, Torvald, and see what I have bought. Don't disturb me. 
bought, did you say? All these things? Has my little spendthrift been wasting money again? Yes, but Torvald, this year we can really let ourselves go a little. This is the first Christmas we have not needed to economize. Still, you no, know bloody hell, why are you spend money recklessly? Yes, Torvald, we may be a wee bit more reckless now, mayn't we? Uh, just a tiny wee bit. You are going to have a big salary and earn lots and lots of money? Yes, after the new year. But then it will be a We're not bloody bed and breakfast, are we? Salary is so get out! Suppose now that I have ah. two pounds today and you spend it all what in Christmas doing? week. And then on New Year's Eve. A slate fell on my head and killed me, and... Oh, don't say such horrid things. Still, suppose that happened. What then? If that were to happen, I don't suppose I should care whether I owed money or not. Yes, but what about the people who had lent it? They? Who would bother about them? I should not know who they were. That is like a woman. But seriously, Nora, you know what I think about that. No debt. No borrowing. There can be no freedom or beauty about a home life that depends on borrowing and debt. We two have kept bravely on the straight road so far, and we will go on the same way for the short time longer than there need be any trouble. As you please. Come, come, my uh, uh, Skylamp has not through her wings. What is this? You will leave my little squirrel out of temper. He's got blood on his hands! You can't kill all of us! That's the one! He's got blood on his hands! He's the killer! Save a bit for the next minute. Jesus. Oh my god. I can't keep doing this. And you know how difficult it is to uproot dandelions? They just keep growing back. Which is lovely because you can eat them. Did you know that? But I digress. <laughs> the way I'm going to do it. All you need to know, my dear, is that. Off about this later. <laughs> How did they guys to run the hundred meters? It's always dark. Would you like this? Brilliant! Knew we could count on you, Alfie. Hey, everybody, Peach is back. But look, Charlie Croak has been wounded. He needs a first aid kit. Can you get one? I knew you could. Here's the top secret blueprint for making one. And you can find the ingredients on this map. I suppose you do have to look out for your friends.
I can't keep doing this. Save a bit for the next minute. I hope you like this sort of thing. Okay. Here's the mission we've all been training for. You have to find the secret mystery house and bring back the ephemeral linen. Now, listen carefully. You can only get into the secret mystery house at night and only when the doors of your perception have been cleansed. Once you've got the ephemeral linen, we'll be able to construct our secretest weapon. It's called a suit of blending for Peachy. We can use it to sneak into Dr. Verloc's secret lair and stop his evil plan for good. All right, Alfie. Don't come back without the ephemeral linen. A suit of blending? He's talking about camouflage, isn't it?
Is there uh, room for me on your log? My god, Eric. H how long have you been out here? Just last week. I thought there'd be more of us, actually. So many people had gone from the village. Most of us don't last very long. Oh. When did you... Two months ago. We think we must have got a bad batch of joy. Oh. So... You're still with... Harold. I'm supposed to meet him in half an hour. Don't go. I'll get into trouble if I don't go soon. Don't go yet. Well, that's a rather awkward way to catch up on old times. Entirely sure they're Anglicans. just happened.
What have we come to? I think Father McCartney would approve. Smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. to us within the sacred triangle. Let him come to us who was dead, but now... We're not a blood... I've always liked you, actually. Agree to disagree?
Shit! This is for you. Brilliant! Now we can make the suit of blending. Here's the secret instructions. Yes, the other agents find that very useful. Am I really making my own choices? Always he's got the madness, hasn't he? There's a bird on the loose! Help! 